Good afternoon, Frank Lee from the Tuskegee Digital Network. My quest, Delafield. Glad to have you with us, man. You are a defensive back. You're from the state of Florida. You're a senior as a member of the Golden Tiger football team. You are a defensive back. Tell us a little bit about yourself and tell us a little bit about what we can expect from the Golden Tigers in the 2022 seasons as we get ready for the Red Tails Classic. I'm Marquez Delafrey. I'm from Florida, Green Coast Springs. Um, a little 15 minutes outside of Jacksonville, Florida. And, you know, we can expect a lot of winning this year, most definitely. My question, you know, when you and I talked uh, off camera, you told me that you were defensive back, and I was teasing you and asking you how many picks, but we're going to take it one game out of, at a time. You, uh, you told me, tell me what your major is at Tuskegee, my question. My major is psychology. You're in psychology, and I'm sure you're going to use a little psychology on those Sport Valley State Wildcats on uh, Sunday in Montgomery. What does it mean to come back into the 2022 season? Last year was a season that's behind us. Uh, it wasn't as impressive as you would have wanted it. It wasn't as impressive, impressive as if a lot of people wanted it to be. But this year is a redemption year. Last year we didn't have the fans. We didn't have the Golden Tiger fan base. Many of the home games, your mom and your dad, your cousins, your nephews, your friends, if you have have some, couldn't see you play. What does it mean this year coming back as a leader? You're a senior, you played Juco ball, and you are coming back this year in a, in a redemption type season. What can we expect from that Golden Tigers secondary this year? Oh, we're going to be the number one in the nation, most definitely. Okay. Takeaways, turnovers, everything, interceptions, forced fumbles, running to the ball. It's going to be completely different. You know, Marquez Tuskegee has a reputation from being the DB capital. You know, most of the Golden Tigers that have gone and played at the next level have been defensive backs. Um, I mean, I'm sure you know Frank Walker. You've heard of Drayton Franz. You've heard of uh, some guys from Florida. I know I can just call the role. What does it mean as a senior to put on that crimson and gold on Sunday night and go back and look around and play for a large crowd? I'm sure you have family and friends there. What does it mean to play in a classic like the Red Tails Classic? Uh, you know, it's a blessing just to be able to play in it um, with the history of the school and the institution and be able to go out there and run out there with my fans and my friends and um, teammates. You know, it's a blessing. Okay, that's, that's, that's a good answer. Tell me, this year you play for Coach Slater. You have a new coach this year. We, we can't say enough about the past, but Coach Reginald Ruffin is the head football coach now at Tuskegee. You have a new uh, cadre of coaches, some new players. How have you adjusted to this new uh, form of uh, this new sports administration as far as the football team? A lot of new schemes, a lot of new plays. Uh, how have you adjusted to that, and what uh, what has that meant to you as a senior? It's been a seamless transition. You know, good. I put the work in the off season. That's I work good. on my mental, my stamina, my technique, most importantly. And you know, with the new scheme, it really challenges you. So it's preparing me for the next level or whatever to come that we're going to see the whole season. Fort Valley State last year, we didn't do as well as we wanted to. Uh, it's a voice of redemption. You know, you got a lot of anger uh, coming into the ball game. When you lose, you have that grudge. You have that animosity. You have that determination. You have that competitiveness. We're going to see that, I'm sure, from, from the defensive side of the ball game on Sunday evening in Montgomery. We're going to see the Golden Tigers scratching and fighting. I always call this game the Battle of the Cats. But you know, the Tiger is the biggest one of those cats. And what can we expect? A dub. Okay, expect all right. Man. Well, that's good. Marquez, thank you so, so much for taking time to come out. We wish you well. Congratulations on this new season. And we're going to be counting those 10 picks. Yes, sir. All right, take care. Good job.